Ross. Whatever you're thinking, Ross, don't do it. I, you're the DA, Ross. And you see the pain and suffering that guns cause every day. I know, I know that you do. Just having a gun, just, just holding one, can change you. And if you don't believe me, then just think of Lizzie, Ross. She killed a man because there was a gun there waiting. Ross, I, I, know, I know that you're hurting, but using that gun is not going to make anything better. Just, just put down the gun, Ross. For Blake and for the children, Ross, just, just put down the gun. shoot anybody, Ross. You're gonna shoot me first. Now give me the gun. You don't want to do this, Ross. Your boys need you. Don't do this. What you did just now, what you tried to do. I didn't do this for you, you, you pig. I did this for my sister because she loves her husband. You hear me? She loves Ross. She didn't love you. Let me tell you something. If what he said was true, if you put a hand on her, you're gonna wish I took this gun and blew your head off because I'm gonna pull you apart piece by piece until there is nothing left. You hear me? Dead. What do, you, what do you think? You know Blake? You don't know Blake. You, Ross Holly, you don't know Blake. Not even close. Forgive me for making the choices that I have made. I love Blake so much. I love my boys and the life that you have given us. Forgive me for letting hate become more important than the blessings you have bestowed upon. my brother's blood on my hands. Forgive me because I still want him dead. I want him to pay for what he did to Blake. Dear God in heaven, I no longer care what happens to me so long as Blake doesn't suffer anymore. Amen. God may forgive you, Ross. But I never will. 